What is up Geek Lifeline family? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Cody, this is Josh, and we have a death battle reaction for you today. We are reacting to the newest death battle, Gojo versus Makima. Now you guys know, if you follow the channel, that we have reacted to both Jujutsu Kaisen and Chainsaw Man. So we are very well aware of both characters. Now if they do pull some stuff from the mangas, you know, we, we're not well versed in that area, but I think that this is going to be a very good battle. Who gonna win? Who gonna win? Who, who, who gonna win? Who? I don't know. I don't know if Makima mm. can go through like Gojo's, mm. Gojo's, you know, you can't touch me situation. I'm voting. I want Gojo to win because he's Gojo Sensei and I love him. <laughs> but uh, Makima's pretty OP. Advertising Hello Fresh, but that's not what they decided. How a beautiful day! The sun is shining, the birds are singing, and a giant AK-47 carpet bombs the sky. Rains blood, millions are dead. Here comes Magma. If you're into the capitalist and divorced alcoholic rednecks, uh, you know to go. <laughs> I don't know how to handle this array of information I've just received. I mean, the crazy thing is, we basically knew everything about Gojo. That was said. Everything. Everything about Gojo. We knew very little <laughs> well my understanding this is just rumor that the show isn't coming back anyway. it was so popular Joe, let's go. I hope you don't kill me too quickly. That should be good. You're so weak. 
You're telling me uh, that Makama couldn't handle his domain expansion. She can't handle the overflow of thoughts. Gojo and Makama were complicated to compare. On the surface level, Gojo busted limitless. Makama lost control of her despite. Makama thought she had Gojo by the ball and chain, but in the end, she was left hollow. The winner is Satoru Gojo. Let's go, Gojo Sensei. Gojo. Gojo took the win. Let's go, Gojo Sensei. I knew you could do it. We only did this one because we watched Jujutsu Kaisen and Chainsaw Man. Um, so, the battle itself was super interesting, but I had a hard time getting past the lackluster voiceover. I felt like it was lacking a lot. Um, yeah. Making it kind of like... It kind of, to me, took away from the excitement of the battle itself. But that was, that. I mean, you know, I'm probably going to get a lot of crap for saying that, but that's just how I felt in the situation. Probably not. I mean, sometimes they get the voice acting to be good, and sometimes they do not get the voice acting to be good. And I think it also has to go with, like, what scenario you're trying to create for these characters. Kamazi doesn't really talk a whole lot either, so so far anyway. But I kind of felt like even if she is kind of like she talks less, she's a little bit more um, what's I don't know, quiet and kind of doesn't express much. Doesn't have much expression. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like they filled that into Gojo as well, and Gojo has a lot of expression. Um, and he gets really excited about fighting. So I just feel like, um, I, I don't know. I just feel like in the voiceover system, they could have done better. The fight itself was amazing. Gojo won, so I can't complain there. <laughs> and uh, I feel like some of the knowledge that we had on Gojo, you know, was right when we, well, I don't know if you thought we win, but when I made my decision on that. I mean, we didn't really know much about Makima, so. Yeah, no, we didn't. So um, that's why so I that was, was kind of like, hard, but. I don't really know anything other than the fact that she can just blow people up. We got tons of spoilers <laughs> in the uh, information area. So, of course, we like we said before we started, we don't read the manga, so. I'm a little heartbroken. Um, I feel like in my own way, I was part of Gojo's uh, infinite domain because I was overloaded with information. <laughs> About Chainsaw Man? About Chainsaw Man. About Devil? Oh, I'm heartbroken. It's hilarious. Well, that's all we got, right? I guess so. We don't have anything. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Um, you know, if you feel this is spot on or if you feel like it's off some, who you were rooting for to win. Uh, and, yeah, we'll discuss it. Until next time, we are out.